Welcoming your fitness first community. Hope you're okay. We are live this morning with a low impact step workout where we can get up to 3,000 steps or more um, in, in 30 minutes of a little walking workout. Low impact, so there's no pressure, no equipment needed. All you need is a little bit of space on your floor. We're going to do 10 exercises. We're going to do three rounds. So if you haven't got time for three rounds, you can literally do one round, two rounds if you want. That'd be 20, 10 or 20 minutes. If you want to stay, do the full lot. That's 30 minutes of exercise we're going to do. You will need some water. Like I say, a little bit of space, no equipment, but then we're going to get going straight away with a fantastic little workout that will really set you up for the day. It'll increase your step count. Um, what, what have I done now? So 2,000, uh, 270 steps I've done. So I'm going to keep an eye on that, see how many I get done in this workout. I mean, it should be over 3,000 each round, and that's taking it nice and steady. So without further ado, let's get started. Good morning if you're joining me live. Hope you're okay. Catching up in the replay or on YouTube. We're just going to start off nice and light, just walking on the spot. Obviously not going to do it outside today. It's getting a bit dark now. The mornings are drawing in. It's getting a little bit dark. So we're just going to start off with a nice little walking. <clears throat> At all times, keep the core engaged, shoulders back. If you want to put some music on, put some music on. Get yourself feeling good. Get rid of those Monday blues. Set yourself up for the perfect day um, by starting off with this fantastic workout. It really will help you. Just a nice, simple stepping workout. Just help you boost your metabolism, boost your mood, and just set yourself up for today. So nice and easy like i say you can do one round two rounds or just continue with me for all three it's entirely up to you we're going to do 50 seconds of work and then we're going to do um 10 seconds quick changeover so we're going for some front toe tap so just tapping the toe to the front adding a little twist there nice and steady not adding too much in so nice and simple 50 seconds let's go that's it. I can say if you want to get some music on, get your favourite playlist on, motivational playlist, and just really feel your way into this workout, taking it all in your own time, at your own pace. Keep that core engaged, keep the shoulders up high, some nice little taps. That's it. Arms going down, one side to the other. Nice work, everybody. Fantastic. We probably will go a little bit faster if you want to, once you've warmed up a little bit. But I'm going to keep this nice and steady. Just to show you, it doesn't matter how fast you go, you can still get a fair few steps done. That's it. Last few seconds. And shake that off. Good work, everybody. So we're going for a nice little step jack. So we're stepping to the side, arms going nice and steady. That's it. Nice deep breaths. Good work, everybody. Like I say, morning if you're joining me live. Hope you're okay. Fantastic to see a few of you said you were coming this morning. So hopefully a few of you have made it live. If not, you probably catch up in the replay. If you are catching up in the replay or whenever you're catching up, let me know in the comments. That's it. Let me know any steps you get done. Have you do one round, two rounds, or three rounds? I'm always intrigued to see how many steps other people get. That's it. Good work. Fantastic. Keep nice and steady. Like I say, we are just warming up the muscles. All about taking it steady. Nice deep breaths. And good work, everybody. Shake that off. Free move down already. So we're going to go for a nice little back toe tap. So we're just tapping the toes. Nice and steady. Taking the arms forward. Again, keep the core engaged on this one. Really is important because you could just lean forward a little bit. You don't want to lean forward, you want to keep nice and tall. All we're doing is tapping the toe back. That's it, one side to the other. Excellent stuff. Good work, everybody. Anytime you feel like you need to slow down, just walking on the spot will go nice and steady. If you want, it's entirely up to you. Grab yourself a drink whenever you want. We do have a quick 30 seconds at the end of each round. Um, just to grab yourself a quick drink. Entirely up to you. That's it. And 
fantastic. Two, one, and shake that off. Good work, everybody. So we're gonna do nice and simple thigh taps or knee taps. It is the first round, so I'm just gonna go with a bit of a knee tap, thigh tap type thing. Keep the core engaged, keep your head up high. Such an important part. Nice deep breaths. Excellent stuff. Good work. So we can up the pace a little bit if you want after this exercise. It's entirely up to you. But remember, keep the core engaged. Go in your own time at your own pace. This is just a great way to get the body woken up in the morning. Just nice, simple movement. Get all the joints moving. We'll have a little stretch afterwards. And it's just a really good way to start your day, to start your week. It's Monday, baby. New beginnings, fresh start. That's it. Good work, everybody. Fantastic. So we're going to go into a nice little side step now. So we're just literally pushing and pulling side steps, one side to the other. Make it a little bit wide if you want. It's entirely up to you. Go a little bit faster. Like I say, you're in control. It's you against you. Nice little movements. Excellent stuff. Good work, everybody. We got, got four to go. And that was just nice and simple then. Four exercises. And then we've done one round. That's 10 minutes gone already. So, like I said, if you want to just do 10 minutes, feel like that's enough sometimes, or you haven't got time, got busy schedules, you just continue with your day, do a little stretch and move forward. But if you can, let's stay for another round. And good work, everybody. Fantastic. So we're going to go to a nice little ski movement here. Where the arms are going forwards and stepping back. Nice ski movement. Not too far back, not too fast. Might feel a little bit of a stretch in the hip flexor, just in the groin area. So just take it steady. It's nice little ski movement. Standing on my cooker. Let's step forward a bit, Ricky. <laughs> That's it. Good work, everybody. Nice deep breaths. Excellent stuff. Go on, keep pushing. Doing the best you can. Got three moves to go. Excellent. Nice. A little movement really will make a difference to your day. Just by getting these extra steps in. You can get out for a walk bonus, but if you can't, this is a great way to fill that void and shake it off. Good work, everybody. So we've got a V on the floor. We're going to step forward, forward, and back to the middle. And do some little punches as we come forward. Forward, forward, back to the middle. That's it. Nice little V steps are called. Excellent stuff. Just stepping forward again. It's just all in your own time, at your own pace. It is you against you. Remember that. Nobody else. You're not competing against anybody else. Just yourself. Excellent. Little jabs. Good work. Excellent stuff. Three, two, one. And excellent work, everybody. Fantastic. So we've got a nice little heel kick now. If you can, lift your heels up nice and high, kicking your own butt almost. And we're just going to reach across or punch across wherever you are. Just one side to the other. Again, keeping that breathing nice and steady, keeping that movement nice and consistent. You don't need to go too fast. Just go in your own time, at your own pace. That's it, we've got one more move after this. And that is it. One round of a full body step workout. Really, like I say, the best way to start the day. We'll change things up a little bit. Maybe add a few different arm moves to the next round, but you can keep it nice and steady wherever you're at. I'm not going to go fast. I'm just taking it steady. Monday morning. 
two, one, and shake it off. Good work, everybody. So we're just going to do a nice little tapping. So it's that side. That's it. So just tapping the toe and bringing the arms up to like bicep cross curls. That's it. Just front toe taps. We can step across the body. Maybe it feels comfortable. That's it. Fantastic stuff. Last 30 seconds and then we've done 10 minutes of work. That is 10 minutes flown by. Nice, simple, low impact step workout. So last 15 seconds, we'll grab a little drink. A few seconds left. Two, one, and shake that off. Good work, everybody. So what have we done there? 1,100 steps. That's not bad. That's kind of what you want to be aiming for. And that was a steady pace. I wasn't going too fast. Um, if you can get a thousand steps or more, absolutely amazing. So we're going to start off with the walking again. This time, instead of just doing normal walk, we're going to add some punches in there. So a nice strong core. We're going in three, two, one, and let's go. Nice little punches. Just little jabs. Going forwards. That's it. You're getting the steps in and you're working the arms as well. Nice deep breaths. Good work, everybody. Fantastic. Let's keep going. 20 seconds. One last bit on round two now. Two, one, and shake it off. Good work, everybody. Fantastic. So we've got the front toe tap. So we're going to literally add a little bit of a twist in this time. So we're just reaching up across the body, keeping the core engaged, twisting around. That's it. We're just stepping to the front, reaching around. Good work. Nice little to big, bigger toe taps this time, shall we say? A little bit bigger. So it's the second round. We can increase that range of movement. We don't have to go any faster. We'll just increase the range of movement. If we're getting over a thousand steps, it's amazing. Each round, by the end of the workout, over 3,000 steps, which is a fantastic way just to boost um, your metabolism. Like I say, get the body flowing, get the heart rate up a little bit without getting too much of a sweat on. It's just a great way to start the day. One, and shake it off everybody, good work. So we're in with the step jacks. We're stepping side to side. You can bring your arms up a little bit higher this time. And you maybe step out a little bit more if you feel like it. If not, just stay here. It's okay. That's it. Nice little movements. Again, keeping that core engaged, keeping the head up high and get some music on if you want. And even in the last round, if you want to, you got some mini weights, you can have some mini weights to this workout. Just adds that little bit of hard work to it. If you haven't got any weights, grab some tins out of beans out of the cupboard, something, every bit counts if you want. You can do whatever, whatever it may be. You can easily just add a little bit more resistance if you feel like it. I'm keeping this nice and steady though. That's it. And good work, everybody. Fantastic. So we're with that back toe taps again. We're just tapping the toe back. We're going to take our arms back this time. So you feel that nice little movement pushing back. That's it. Nice stretch as well across the chest as you push back. Just tapping the toe behind you. Excellent stuff. Nice deep breaths. Good work, everybody. Fantastic. Keep going. Keep moving. 
<clears throat> we're on exercise number four already on round two so flying through it again like i say this is to be put in your own time at your own pace so if you can only do what one round two rounds that's fine it's still making a difference it's still two thousand steps if you do two rounds and shake that off good work everybody in with the knee taps yeah two thousand steps even if you can only do two rounds so we're going to bring the knees up a little bit higher this time now the legs are warmed up hips are warmed up the core's warmed up so let's get those movements a little bit higher help you build strength mobility that's it nice strong core Excellent work, everybody. Go on. Five exercises to go on. Round two after this. If you do finish after two rounds, though, please make sure you do a few, few stretches. Just to... Um, one round's not too bad. But if you're doing two rounds, you just need to do a few stretches to help you. Just... Muscles just relax a little bit. And shake that off. Good work, everybody. In with a side step. So step into the side. This time, I'm going to take our arm up and over if you can. Up one side to the other. That's it. Reaching up for the stars. Good work. Just adds a bit more movement to it sometimes. Fantastic stuff. Nice deep breaths. Fifteen seconds to go. Go on, three moves to go after this. Four moves to go, sorry. <laughs> Miscounting already. Three, two, one and shake it off everybody good work so we're back in with that ski mo motion motion ski motion <laughs> you might see some mooses while you're skiing but now we're on a ski motion go on that's it good work nice little step back <sighs> nice deep breaths getting a bit warmer now like i say your heart rate's up so you are working 120 in activity minutes so are already up so that's good like i say it does get the heart rate up a little bit it should do should be working not have it too easy where you're not feeling it a little bit it's all low impact so you shouldn't be hurting any knees or anything like that should be nice and steady and if this is your level and you feel like this is enough you could just do this three times a week this workout and you'll be able to build up your fitness i promise you that guaranteed so right v step so forward forward back to the middle this time we're going to do roller arms so we'll change it up a little bit rolling the arms forwards and then we'll swap halfway through and roll them backwards so we're not only waking up the body we're waking up the mind We've done my little morning meditation this morning to settle the mind. That's it. Such an important part of my day. Should be one of the best things to do. Start your day, calm the mind, set yourself up, do a workout, and you really will set yourself up for the day. So much better than just staring at to scrolling through social media. Or whatever looking at the news and good work everybody doing things that don't do your mind any good and we're in with the heel kicks again this time again just reaching across the body make it nice and steady yeah cutting the news out any negativity any things first thing in the morning like that will massively improve your well-being your mental health because it just fills you full of worry and anxiety. I have not watched the news for, I think it's five years almost now, coming on, since COVID. Um, 
not watched it since then. I guess that not affected my life one bit. Doesn't I don't need to know what's going on out there. Some people call it ignorant. I call it looking after my own mental well-being. And I would recommend it to you. Unfollow any news feeds, anything that comes up with a bit of news on it. Unfollow it. And it will really make a difference to your mental well-being. I promise you that now. So nice little tapping. So tapping across the bar and bringing those cross arms back. Nice little toe taps. Last one on round two. That's 20 minutes of exercise or low impact workout, um, which should get you over 2,000 steps or nearby, which is amazing. Nice deep breaths. That's it, good work. Probably is becoming light enough now, but it's raining outside. It looks like it's raining, it looks very damp. Fingers crossed it comes good. I like taking the, walking the kids to school, having a little walk back. It's nice just to get out and have that fresh air in the morning and good work everybody. Fantastic stuff. So, two rounds down. Number 1,100 steps, exactly. Well, I say exactly, nothing's ever perfect. So it's not far off. It's not far off. So this time I'm gonna do a little brisk march. So we're gonna speed it up a little bit if you want, otherwise just keep the nice walking. So three, two, one, and let's go. So if you're continuing for this third round, you could add those dumbbells, add some light dumbbells, some beans, wherever you're at and if you finish well done you 2000 steps plus is amazing start to the day but if you're continuing let's add that little march let's get that pace up a little bit for the last little bit if you want see i'm not going to help forever it's not a fast march it's just a nice brisk walk a little bit faster than before arms pumping a little bit more nice deep breaths excellent work On, last few seconds, last round. <clears throat> and shake it off, everybody. Good work. So we've got the front toe taps. This time we're going to reach down. Reaching down and round. That's it. As if you're picking something up from the floor, twisting really will help you build strength. Excellent stuff. Good work, everybody. Keep pushing. That's it. 20 seconds. Come on, last round. Can you give it a little bit more? Yeah, I've got weights in your hands or tins in your hands. You're just working that a little bit more. It'll help burn a few more calories, help you tone up, build strength. Three, two, one and good work everybody fantastic stuff so in with the step jacks so taking the arms up again if you've got those weights in your hands you're working the shoulders a bit more that's it let's go come on last round could you go a little bit faster it's entirely up to you like i say heart rate's up at 126 now so it's working a little bit harder it's a great way to get the metabolism going Work in a cardio zone, fat burning zone. So, any little bit of exercise done in the morning or whenever will boost your metabolism. So, your metabolism will be working harder and you'll be burning more calories throughout the day. So, if you're sticking to a good calorie deficit um, and sticking to healthy foods and working out, you're more likely to lose weight quicker than people just doing a calorie deficit and no exercise. So it all helps, remember, every little helps. So we've got the back toe taps, so nice little toe taps, and we're gonna just double punch as we come forward. That's it. So just tapping the toe behind you, double punch, 
coming forward. Good work, everybody. Come on, we've got just over six minutes to go. We are almost there. Literally, you've turned up. You've done amazing. You've pushed through. You're smashing this low impact step workout. Like I say, please let me know in the comments how many steps you've done. It's a, it's a good way just to see where you're at. And then also it's a record. You can go back and go, right, write it down for yourself. How many steps did I do last time? Let's see if I can improve on that step count this time. Like I say, the only competition is you, not me. And good work, everybody. Fantastic stuff. Back in with the knee taps. Nice, simple knee taps. Lifting your knee a little bit higher. That's it. Good work. Come on, last round. Nice deep breaths. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excellent stuff. Come on, keep going. Five exercises down after this one. Five minutes to go. All the way to the end. That's it. Excellent stuff. If you've got the dumbbells in your hands or beans, just go to the side of your knee. Just like that. Excellent work. 10 seconds to go. Last little bit. Five, four, three, two, one. And shake it off. Just grab yourself a little drink. We're in with the side steps. Some nice little side steps. I'm going to go back to what we did in the beginning. Push and a pull. Going forwards and backwards. Again. If you want to make it harder, you just make the steps a bit bigger or just do it a bit faster. That's it. You might get in a little bit of a sweat on now, which is a good thing. Sweat, good. So, excellent work. Keep pushing. it people go on keep going 13 seconds to go come on We've got four moves to go after this you're doing amazing let's keep pushing through two one and shake it off we're back in with a ski movement that's how close we are to the end now literally four moves to go <clears throat> heart rates up high activities up high steps are good Let's keep it going all the way to the end. You've turned up for a reason. Let's make it count. Like I say, what a great way to start the day. Fantastic stuff. I've just started my six week online program as well. So if you are part of this, let me know when you've done a workout. And we'll, uh, it's absolutely brilliant. I encourage and support each other in our little community to help your physical and mental well being. Two, three, and good work, everybody. So instead of a V step this time, I'm going to keep our feet a little bit wider. I'm going to do a box step. So forward, forward, back, back, just keeping the feet wide. Nice, simple, and then little punches again. So just keeping the legs wide as if you've got a big square on the floor and you're going one corner to the other corners. That's it. And punching as we come forward. Excellent stuff. Come on, you're doing amazing. Keep pushing. Good work, everybody. Excellent work. Keep digging deep. Oh, 10 seconds. We've got less, or just over, sorry, than two minutes. We've got two exercises to go. And you've absolutely smashed it. Well done, everybody. Keep pushing through right to the end. Last two. Rim with a heel kick. Nice little heel kick. And this time we're going to punch up to the sky. Come on. Reaching for the stars. Let's go for it. Nice deep breaths, come on. 
you can do it. Oh, it looks like the weather's turning a bit better now. Fingers crossed for the day. But whatever will be, will be. The weather doesn't affect my mood. Only I do. That's it. And this is a good way to just boost your mood. The first thing in the morning, like I say, it's a new week, new beginnings, a new online challenge. Just started. So it's great. Feeling good. One more move to go. You absolutely smashed it. Low impact, 3,000 step workout. And shake it off, everybody. So in with the toe taps. Just tapping it across the body. Nice little movement. Good work doing the bicep cross curls. Excellent stuff. Last 40 seconds. That is it. Good work, everybody. Right to the end. I'd say let's check on our steps. Let me know in the comments what sort of steps you did. But within half an hour, we've just smashed a low impact step workout, which really does set you up for the day. Last 15 seconds, go on all the way to the end. Like I say, when you're getting ready, get your favorite playlist on now. Listen to some music, make yourself feel good. Three, two, one, and shake it off. Good work, everybody. Grab yourself a little drink. You've done absolutely amazing. So, we've done 3,600 steps, and I've only done 200 before. Well, 270, so um, that is absolutely amazing. 37 active minutes, so that is a really good little way to start the day. We'll finish off with a nice little stretch. Just stretch the arms across. Lifting the heels if you want, whatever you're at, swaying the hips, hover arm, just a little stretch, massively important. It's a good way just to finish off any workout. Like I say, I've got a little bit of a sweat on there myself, so definitely, definitely improves your physical um, well-being. Pull your leg through, nice quad stretch, there's been a lot of quad work there. Working the legs. So yeah, hold on to something if you need to. If you don't, just stand tall. And to the other side. Oh, he says. <laughs> Excellent stuff. A nice stretch. And a hamstring stretch. Reaching down, flex your foot back towards you. One leg bent. Oh, nice stretch for the lower back, that one. Excellent work again. Like I say, hope you enjoyed that. Let me know how many steps you did. We've got about 3,300 just over, which is amazing. Um, it's a great way to start the day. Oh, nice. Stretching down to the other side. Yeah, a great way to start the day. Getting your heart rate up. Healthy heart, healthy mind, healthy body. I'm going to get some healthy food in there. Take care, everybody. Thank you for joining me live. Um, hope you have a great day. And we're back on Friday with another fantastic full body workout. So take care, everybody. And as always, remember, it's your mind, your body, your fitness first. Have a great day. See you all soon.